There we go then. Have you resolved the situation in the factory? This just confirms my suspicions. The computation engine highlighted Ludlow as a peacemaker, so the workers are back to work. Fine, I'll talk to her. Just as soon as we start getting things out the door again. You've done good work. Let me pay you for it, but don't go anywhere. Before I handed the creation of the computation engine over to Dai, it was the project of my partner, Blue. Sadly, Blue and I had a little falling out over design decisions, and now he's my... Anyhow, when he left, he stole a gizmo called the Synaptic Degausser, which is the only tool that can fix the engine without me having to redesign it from the ground up. And there's no way that's happening before the gang... We back to Degausser, and you get another paycheck. Oh, and you better take Die with you again. She knows what the damn thing looks like. Out in the scrapyard someplace, leading some other ex-workers of mine who've decided to get back at me for my crime. The refugees out there call them the ghost gang because no one knows where their hideout is. I call them losers. Couldn't hack real work, so now they're playing at bandits. Pathetic. Fair enough, ask. I came here from the Motor City Combine, what folks used to call Detroit. But it was an industrial city, too. We knew how to build, <clears throat> smelt, tool, mass produce. Could have been. Greed happened. Greed and stupidity. The Buckeye Republic ordered a hundred tanks and a thousand guns from our biggest makers. All those fools could see were those pretty Buckeye. Weren't they surprised when those sod kicking Puritans took delivery of all those tanks and guns and drove them right back up the Erie Shore to the MCC? Caught up. That war is still going on, I guess. I left before they got north of Flat Rock. Never looked back. What didn't I do? Started on the line in a truck plant and worked my way up to operations manager. Did every job in between, too. But what I really liked was automation and analytics. Pretty soon I got the idea to start something of my own. Walked out of that plant with Blue, who's a shit hot engineer, and we set up a shop in the ruins. Started scavenging for old computers and robots. We just found Di and we're having her bug fix and maintenance scheduling algorithm we were prototyping when those buckeye bastards came rolling up. The three of us packed a truck and headed west, looking for a buyer. Old Saul was the first to make a serious offer. Saul gave me a lump of coal. I made a diamond out of it. His empire was growing fast, but his resources were lagging. He needed more vehicles, heating systems, radios, guns. All the things that make a civilization. <laughs> he had some yeah, that down here make a civilization. Make for him by hand. The tools One of self destruction. Months. I told him I could make him 10 a month. He fired the duffer, put me using computer assisted automation. I've been able to revive forgotten manufacturing processes and deliver products nobody's seen since the deluge. Steel Town is now up. That's why I need to find out why my computation engine is malfunctioning. I'm the one who built all this, and I still couldn't keep it running without that thing's help. And that would be bad because if Steel Town fails, Colorado fails with it. He relies on it. Without the weapons I make, the Eastern gangs would have him outgunned and overrun. Without my heaters and radios and generators, he couldn't give his people the creature comforts that make them think he's a god. Of course, I rely on him too. It's a partnership. He keeps Colorado safe and attractive, and that creates a steady market for the things I make. We share a vision of Colorado rising strong. Helping, like getting my synaptic degausser back. Sure, good. We don't have long. Now get going. Okay, to scrapyard it is. Oh wait. We can trade now. <clears throat> Another shining example of the products we produce. Hey, cats. I'm Serena Ash. You got it, cats. No. Damn it.
<clears throat> okay now, okay now. Weird science, man. Robots and vehicles. Interesting. What the fuck? Hey now, cats. You got it, cats. Hi there. Sorry. Look, I have to say this stuff. It's in the script. But I'm wearing the floor model. Most of the armor padding and Kevlar have fallen off. It's basically just a plastic shell. So please... Uh, okay. Oh, wait. I forgot part of my sales pitch. Uh, the ones who follow Liberty. Supposedly, she sent them out. That was before my time. Supposedly, now, I guess, he robs us as revenge for Markham firing him or something. Which, I mean, that's not cool. Uh, um, sure. Steel Town's finest. Let's keep these three just in case. You know what fucking know.
How can I help you, sirs and or madams? Have a nice shift. Okay. 